All right, George Kembosis just announced the rematch. It's on. How are you feeling? Yeah, it's great. You know, I'm uh, very excited to uh, you know officially be back on, and um, and I'm, I'm looking forward to doing my talking in the ring on October 16th. Looking back on that first fight, how do you assess your performance, and and, and what do you think of the fight? Yeah, look, uh, it is what it is. You know, the fight didn't go the way it planned. You know, certain things, certain aspects of the fight, you know, weren't uh, you know, the way I thought they'd be. That's for me to, to, to make changes, and I've already made changes and adapt and come back. You know, better fighter, like I said in the press conference, losses are a good thing. So I thank Devin Haney you know, for giving me my lesson. If I come back now as a better fighter. So, you know, I just hope that you know justice is done in this fight. You know, regardless of who wins the fight, justice is done with, with a good fight for the fans, the hard paying fans, because we saw in that first fight that there was a lot of holding, a lot of things that you know, broke momentums. And took the crowds out of you know, such a spectacular event, a spectacular event. so you know, it'll be different here. Rod Laver is a, a, a coliseum, small, you know, and, and that's why I wanted it. You know, a, a place where you will hear everything, and I uh, hope uh, the referee that is appointed you know, does justice for, the, for a great fight between me and Devin Haney. With a free VIP package to watch Canelo versus Triple G live in Las Vegas, free tickets, free signed merch, free party at High Lounge. VIP access to the weigh-in. Big thanks to our buddies over at Stagefront for making this possible and partnering with us to go ahead and do this giveaway. You guys gotta check them out. They put together some really cool VIP packages for the fights. Marcos, how do I win this? Click on the link in the description on this video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Follow us on all social media platforms. Winners are announced August 31st. Now get back to watching this video. What was the game plan going into that fight? Was it just a mismatch of styles that you couldn't do what you wanted no, no, to do? Not, or was it a mismatch? Just certain things didn't go the right way. And, um, you know, there's, there's certain things, but that's not for me, for me to, to look back on. And I'm looking to the future and I know what I do best. And I know with the people I have around me, you know, we'll be uh, victorious on October 16th. Excited to have that underdog mentality back and a little bit less pressure mm. uh, in this rematch? Yeah, it's, it's really good, you know, for me now. Uh, I've got no commitments, you know, I'm low key, out of sight, out of reach. Not, not uh, you know, everyone's knocking, trying to find where Cambosis is. You know, I'm uh, back to where I've always been, you know, in the trenches. When I said it before, I'm in the trenches when I was champion, I was lying. I admit that. I was never in the trenches, so this time I'm back to, to what is familiar. And plus, more, more because, you know, like I said, when, when a man loses, you know, everything off him, you know, it becomes dangerous because now, He's got nothing to lose. So everything he d does in that ring or in life, you know, he's, uh, he's bringing the best. There's been a lot of talk about Haney's jab. Um, mm. How do you negate his jab in this fight? Or is there more things you need to do as well? That's for October 16th. I'll do my talking in the ring. All right. So how does this fight play out and why do you think you get the win? And you, two times. That's, 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 that's how it will be. I just want to get your thoughts quickly on uh, Anthony Joshua, Usyk fight mm. on the weekend. Uh, did you watch the fight? What did you think of it? I did watch the fight, obviously. Uh, you know, uh, big fan. Not even, not even uh, me and uh, Usyk talk. Um, I'm a big fan, you know, of, of Usyk. And obviously a big fan of Anthony Joshua as well. And, you know, you could see everyone's talking about the meltdown, but that's just pride. That's just passion. You know, there's a lot on the line for us fighters. And sometimes you put your whole life into it and things don't go right. And for the general person, when things don't go right, no one really gets to see. But for us fighters or athletes, when things don't go right, the whole world gets to see. Millions of people get to see. So, um, look, there's always a lot of pressure. You know, Joshua will be back. And uh, Usyk, I want to see uh, you know, him fight Tyson Fury. I know he wants that fight. So, you know, the boxing gods. Please make that fight happen. So what's the, the next seven weeks look like for you as we lead into this fight? Yeah, out of reach, out of sight. Good luck, George. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching this video. And make sure to subscribe for more videos of your favorite fighters over here on Fight Up TV. And give us a follow online as well at Fight Up TV, on Twitter, and on Instagram. We appreciate it, guys.